Hey, buddy. What's up? Oh, you have an assignment on fossils. Let's learn about fossils today. Fossil is the word we use to describe a wide range of natural artifacts. It is the preserved remains of a living organism, such as a plant, insect, or an animal. The word fossil comes from the Latin word fossils, meaning obtaining by digging. Fossils are very important for us if we want to know what happened before us or before our time. The scientists who specialize in studying fossils are called paleontologists. Let's learn about types of fossils. Trace fossils. What happens when you step in mud? Millions of years ago when dinosaurs roamed the earth, they also made large footprints. Fossilized footprints are called trace fossils because they were made by the activity of the dinosaurs. Footprints can tell about the size of the animal, number of legs they had, how they moved, and how fast they could run. Ancient fossilized homes of animals tell us about how and where ancient animals lived. Any fossil that explains the activity of ancient creatures is a trace fossil. Examples, burrows, borings, footprints, and root cavities. Mold fossils. Mold fossils are fossils formed when a plant or animal dies and is covered by sediment. Its flesh decays with times and bones deteriorate, and it leaves a cavity below the ground surface. Cast fossils. It is formed when the formed mold fossil is filled in by surrounding minerals and sediment. It is a replica of the original organism and provides an impression of the original structure. True form fossils. These are large body parts of an organism that has been replaced by minerals. It's created by a process known as petrification. The word petrified means turning into stone. These types of fossils form when minerals replace all or part of an organism. Examples, limbs, torsos, and heads. Let's see the importance of fossils. Fossil remains can give us an idea about how ancient animals and plants obtained food, reproduced, and how they behaved. Coal, gas, and oil are called fossil fuels because they're formed from the organic remains of prehistoric organisms. They are abundant and accessible, and they provide a huge amount of concentrated energy. It helps us to know about the Earth's history. Geologists gather information from fossils, and it can be used to understand when different layers of rock were formed. Now, you know a lot about fossils. Please drop a like. Leave a comment, share the videos, and don't forget to subscribe. Bye-bye.